smart XLR uh, uses this smart XLR continuing with the video the calculators the previous video I showed you how to make a simple format for calculating taxes and this is our bat calculator so I'm just going to add some more buttons in this or some more things in this so we can make it somewhat both little more advanced so here you can see that if you, if you click this and close you can close and uh, I want to add a percentage label and a text box clear and exit button and how to show that in a macro so whenever you have in the sheet you can just open it directly so let's go to the view code part and here we need to add some more labels and text boxes so first we will do is we will make drag this down so this is this is our total answer one and we will add on more text so we can copy and paste this and i'm going to copy this control c and control v and paste this here so this caption i can i'll be changing into so this is called as label one so i'll be giving this as percent so it will be called percent and this will be changed into again i'll make this into percent so this will be called as percent label this and this text box you can name as percent text box We have whenever you want, you can change the color also. You can see it's green over here, so you can make it into pink or whatever color it is feasible. We have green, so yes, yeah, so now we have written the percent one. Now, still, there is no code written over here, so we should have to write something for percentage. So you can make it zero or you can put a percentage value also here. So like this. And it will show as a value. So I can put a percentage. So it's easy for me to remember that. There's a percentage. And uh, still it's not going to be working because you have to write the codes for this so the codes will be like uh, it's in the old code so you have to tell the new codings so when you click this this value should multiply this and you should get an answer So if you double click this, you have already have code which has written in the previous time. So the new code will be like you have to change this. Okay, and now you have to write that this value is add text. Just copy this.
multiplied by this value so this person need to copy this so if you multiply it will be double but that should be divided by 100 So once you divide by 100, you will get the percentage value answer. And apart from that, if you want, you can make this into a format also. So let's see and run this code. So if I make this into 1000 and this is into 5. So you get 50. So this is 5% is 50. If you make this into again 100,000, you get this as 5,000. Now we have this, but I don't want to each keep on clearing this every time. So you can say I have to do it manually. I would like to have some command buttons here so it will clear and exit the screen. So let's do that now. So what is the name of this calc is vat calc vat underscore calc is the frame name so now what we'll do is we will not do in text box or label box we will do a command button so this is a text box this is a label and we have to see a command so this is a command button so i'll click this over here and then we making this command button one and I will give this as clear screen. Let's go let's see what in the caption I will change this into clear screen. We can make it a little more molded. And I will copy this again and I will paste this here. Control C, Control V. And I will make this into this is our command button one now. So I will make this and exit. Oh, you can't make exit because exit is a variable function for this. So we can make this into. And here we can change the caption into exit. So now we have to write a command for this. For clear screen, it should be like wet calcium. So this is the name of the label. I will be opening this here, clear screen, and I have to type a code that will be called as unload. and the name will be like rat underscore gabci. I think this is the right name. And again, I have to show that, so I'll be writing this again. Control C, Control V. I'll be writing dot to show. This is for the clear button. This is the command unload and show. 
so let's see if it is working so if i have some data please and if i make this into 44 percent this is the answer and yeah this is the answer it's getting clear now this exit is not working so i have to make an exit command for this so i'll be going to this again on an exit I will be showing this. So now I have to type the command. So the same name I will be copying this. Let calcy dot type. So this is the command to exit. So so let's go and check this now. So you can see it has been exiting. So now I want to make a comma macro button. So I don't want to come in every time and click here. So I don't want to, if I want to see this, I don't want to come again and again over here. So I make a command button. So command so I macro button so I can open it directly. So I'll be inserting in the module. So what is that doing this? And this will be like I'll give the name as show Kelsey. Show Kelsey. So the name I will be in the sub show. Brad Kelsey, the name is the form name over here. Dot. So let's close this and now let's make a button inside developer tab. Let's <laughs> edit the text. Okay, now you can see when I click it, we can get the things on board. So, if you want to make any amount and whatever percentage you want, you can get you will get the answer if you make it two percent. So I hope you find this video useful and in the next feature I will be showing you how to make the total for this and apart from that I will be showing you how to make a percentage, a percentage calculator and CST, GST calculator and calculator in frames and other things. I'm sorry about my voice is not correct at this moment. But I hope you understand this video and uh, it's very easy to follow. If you are, it's, if it's slow, just go to YouTube and click the uh, normal instead of normal mode, make it fast mode into two. So the video will be a little more faster and you can grasp the things quickly. So I hope you find this video. Please uh, subscribe to the channel, please share this video so many people can understand the use of calculators and thank you for watching